My name is Elvi Musica, and I have glaucoma. I had congenital cataracts as a child, many surgeries, which probably is the reason why in my early 30s I developed glaucoma. Glaucoma was manageable with marijuana. I found out a year after I took it. Unfortunately, nobody else believed me, and so I underwent a tremendous amount of surgeries, which left me totally blind in this eye because I am one of four people who receives medical marijuana from the federal government. That's something I want as a result of a trial where I was uh, facing five years in jail and God knows what else uh, for growing a few plants to control my glaucoma, which nothing they had in their arsenal could take care of. And we proved that in court. Then I became the first woman in this country to receive marijuana from the federal government, which was supplying two people marijuana that is grown at the University of Mississippi at your tax dollars expense and is provided to four of us and whatever research they allowed. And I was out there in near Idaho and we had a senator listening to us and we were giving a lot of testimony of why uh, they should join us. And after the meeting was over, the police had kind of been looking for people uh, to be in their cars. And of course, we were all patients, so they pretty much um, decided that they could catch people with marijuana. They stopped uh, my friends and I. Uh, they were driving me back to the hotel, and they made the driver, who was the designated driver and wasn't doing any medicine at all, uh, walk around the car several times and do the sobriety test, which he obviously passed. And also they took my friend's medicine and mine, even though we were documented. I had no hesitation in giving them my prescription because all prescriptions are federal. No doctor can prescribe anything unless he has a federal license to do that. And so I handed him my prescription and told him who I was, but they they held on to mine. Two hours later, they returned everybody else's belongings and identification papers, but not mine. I had to go to the station the following day to retrieve my medicine, my prescription. Thank God I'm in Oregon and patients are allowed to share with patients. Otherwise, that means, you know, uh, my glaucoma was out of control for quite a few hours there after they took my medicine. But um, they said that the reason they harassed us is because federal authorities have been telling Oregon authorities to go ahead and continue to search for marijuana and that wherever they find it confiscated, even if it belongs to patients who have legitimate state licenses to possess it. No matter how hard you try, you can't stop us now. No matter how